start general thoughts on the game? Well, you know, the, the game kind of today was about one guy, and, and you know, Brookshire was absolute fantastic. Um, when you strike out 14 and walk one in a game, it puts a lot of pressure on the other team. Offensively, they did enough early uh, to give him a lead, and, and once he had that lead, I felt like he was really about as good as anybody we had faced all year long. He, he was really, really good, and, and uh, we just couldn't get over the hump. Jim, you guys were like the fifth hardest team to strike out in the league. I know it's one of the 10, 11 teams in the league, and you were kind of middle of the pack, but it was it's difficult statistically. To use. So how you know how extraordinary was it to see what their guy did to, to your hitter? I, th I thought he was outstanding. You know, if you, if you just walked up and watched him, I felt like that uh, his body language and all said, I'm in total control. Mm -hmm. And he was the same way when he pitched at our place, but he was on a pitch count. And uh, he threw all of his pitches for strikes. He located extremely well, pitched ahead in the count. And when you do that, you know, it's not like he throws the ball hard enough to go through a wall, but he throws hard enough. And, uh, and he, he made some guys look pretty bad. We, he, he fooled some guys. But it wasn't really about trickery. It was about making quality pitches. And, and I thought he was really, really good. This is a real rare circumstance for any Jack State club, not just yours, but since we went to go out of the conference tournament two games, and I know it never feels good to go out at any time, but how much, I don't, shocking is too strong a word for me to ask about, but how's that feeling set in with you? I don't, think, I don't think anybody associated with our program would ever be happy if we didn't leave here as the winner, uh, regardless of whether we're two and out or whether it took three games. I mean, we're not, we're not going to be, we're, we strive to win championships, yeah, right. and Jacksonville State deserves that. So we're disappointed, uh, you know, that we weren't able to do that this year. But I think when you step back, you have to evaluate everything, and you say, what kind of effort did you get? Did the, did the kids give everything they had? And in my mind, there's no doubt that they did. It just wasn't good enough this year. We've, we've been up here sometimes when we're our final meeting. We're sitting here as happy as a lark, and we're feeling like a million dollars because we got it done. Somebody will be doing that here in a couple of days. It's just not going to be us this year. And with, you know, with the three hits and just close to get to the cycle. Um, what were you saying specifically against him that helped you to hit that guy today? Um, I was just trying to see the ball and hit it. Uh, I don't really. He was throwing. I knew he was going to throw mostly fastballs because that's what he likes to get ahead with. Mm -hmm. And so I just jumped on the first fastball or the first strike that he threw me. Um. When he pitched against you down there a couple weeks or so ago, um, I mean, he was pretty sharp then. I think he one hit four innings. You were, was he similar today as he was when you faced him a yeah, couple I weeks think, ago? Or was he, I think he was. He may have had a little bit more life on his fastball like four weeks ago, or it may have been a little harder, but mm -hmm. he was throwing all four pitches for strikes. So. And, and what were the other guys saying coming back into the dugout? I mean, you've had three hits, obviously, but, you know, what are the guys that were going down on strikes while they were coming back after facing him, what were they saying about if he was throwing? Uh, I mean, they we all knew that he was a good pitcher, so there wasn't anything, any doubt about that. I think Mike just missed a few balls, and, I mean, if we just a few inches here and there, and then we're in the ball game. so. Really quick. Um, I know it was early, but did you feel, you know, at, at that point that it had this one had pretty a chance to be pretty good for you? I know, even though there was a lot of more time left. Uh, yes, sir. Uh, first thing I did feel good. I was able to locate fastballs, get in on the hands, and then after that, every ground ball they hit felt like it, you know we wasn't in the spot where they hit it. They were just finding gaps, and then a couple walks here and there, and they just got out of hand. And that's what's mean. What what it changed. After, you know, after that, you said they had a couple of seats and then the single they got.